hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm here with a movie reaction this is made in abyss movie number one uh journey's dawn now um why i am doing this movie reaction is because of there's a reason behind it um i i've seen made in abyss the anime uh, when it came out it, it was quite a long while ago that's why i remember almost nothing about it and i do plan on reacting to the sequel that's going to happen uh in the like you know in the next uh few uh next not few so in, in the next month the uh sequel that made in abyss is going to have i want to react to that on my channel so i thought that why not like you know like make a uh, reaction of the movies because the movies also kind of compiles the whole uh journey and since i do need to rewatch this anime instead of just rewatching the anime on my own why not just react to the movie and i do also know that movie number three i think it is something new it is not a recap i don't know what it is about uh, i have not seen that so what i plan on doing is reacting to movie one today next week movie two next week movie three and from the next week i think the sequel is going to start and i'm going to start with the uh, anime sequel that's going to come out from next month so that is how i plan to do this so obviously uh, i have seen the anime i know quite a few things but majority of it i have forgotten that's why i thought about rewatching it so there you go that's what i wanted to tell you guys so there'll be no like you know like there were i think there were a few twists here and there i remember there was that whole section in the end which i kind of vividly remember what happened the whole uh, ending poor portion other than that most of the things i've forgotten so those won't be a surprise for me i just wanted to let you guys know because i've already watched the anime i'm just re-watching the movie i've not watched the movie though but i'm just re-watching uh, the story in itself Anyway, that's just something that I wanted to let all of you guys know. So there you go. Uh, with that out of the way, let's begin. Uh, the first movie is called Journey's Dawn. It, I think it compiles the first eight episodes of the anime. And um, yeah, let's, let's get started then. So this is obviously a movie reaction. So only the subtitles will be given and the timer will be given. Uh, if you want to watch it with alongside me, sync it to the original video and uh, yeah watch my reaction alongside so let's get started this is a two hour movie a long uh, like you know a long video this will be so let's get started so yeah i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is a preference and let's get started okay here's the countdown three two one go I do remember the basis premise, uh, basic premise of it. I think the girl wanted to find his her mom or something. Um, yeah, I, I think it was something like that. And that's why they went on a journey. The the girl and the boy. I don't even remember their names. Like it's been so long. All right, thousand nine hundred years ago. Okay. Huge bit. Is that that kid? That the main character? The kid we saw? People were drawn. Damn. Relics. Damn, that looks that looks cool. Also, it is kind of like this in the middle of the water. There's like a pit. Oh, well, that was water, wasn't it? As I said, I remember almost nothing of it. Oh, is this how everything ah everything developed? Oh, interesting. Wait, I don't think they showed this in the anime, did they? Or I. I don't remember. Wow. I feel like this could be a really good video game, you know? This whole thing. Like, there are certain animes that could be really good as video games. Damn. About 12 years ago, okay.
Yeah, I don't think they showed these in the anime at, at all. Okay, that's interesting. This. Wait, who's. Is that, is that the mom? Yeah. Foreign excavator. Um, whoa, what? Ah, want some more food. <laughs> Movable Lord. Oh, that's his name. Kind of fits him, I think. <laughs> I don't even know they say he or she. She? Oh, that's, that's a girl? Okay. Hmm. Where have I heard her voice? This girl's voice. Wait. Oh, it's oh she was pregnant at this moment. Oh. I don't think they so showed these in the animes, did they? I don't remember these type of scenes. Okay, interesting. That's why I decided to watch the movie, you know, because it might have something extra. Okay. <laughs> ah, here we go. I, I remember this from the anime, this whole section. I think it was the first episode. Yeah. Red whistles, okay. <laughs> Cosmic compass. <laughs> well, <laughs> oh my god, whenever I watch this, the environment and everything, I think so much just how good this will be as a video game. And yep. So these are relics, I'm guessing. Damn. <laughs> yeah, I kind of remember this part in the anime a little. You the onigiri. <laughs> you the onigiri. Oh, here we go. This is where trouble will strike. There you go. Hmm. Crimson split jaw. Oh my god. Oh, wait. Oh, he was. He was injured. Okay. He ate the backpack. What? Uh. Okay. Well, time to run. Oh my god! Oh! Oh yeah. Oh, it's not? Okay. Yeah. I think this is where she meets the other 
the other main character oh my god hmm yeah there you go okay Oh. Damn. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I think, I think it shoot a beam or something. Love the details, the, the, the fire like, which is burning kind of lessens down. Ah, there you go. Okay. I don't even remember any one of those. I don't even remember the girl's name. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Machine. Oh, is that why he's not breathing? Because he's a machine. Ah, I never thought about it. Oh, he shot from there, I think? Oh, maybe. Oh. 100 meter sights. Oh, of the guild orphanage. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Well, looks at her. Yeah. <laughs> well. <laughs> oh my god. She probably. <laughs> okay. Turning up the fire. Up. Get, get an electric shock. Well. 20. Yeah, there you go. God damn. Completely fried him. <laughs> uh. Yeah, that's a great way to wake up with an electric shock. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. What is her name? I don't remember it. Rico. Okay, yeah, Rico. They mentioned it. I forgot it. Ah. 
Belcher orphanage. Ah! Well. Oh, that's why. Hmm. Oh uh, yeah, so she didn't remember. I forgot about that. I don't think that's why he moved. Or maybe. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, I re- Ah. <laughs> uh. Well, because, yeah. Cover him up. <laughs> God, they have a ladder and everything. Oh boy. Oh. oh my god <laughs> that's what he asks that's so obvious just look at it like what <laughs> yeah he's not there yeah there you go I think he was on, on the ceiling or something? <laughs> oh yeah, there you go. I, I remember this part a little bit. Um... <laughs> Clean the orphanage. Clean the whole orphanage. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Yep. You're a robot. Well or something like that. Oh, this is the first time he's seeing himself in the mirror, I think. Probably not. That's interesting observation. Like, you know, like... Belly button is basically the part where the umbilical cord is attached. So why would a robot need that? Ah! Oh my god. Go go on the ceiling again. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Handy hand. <laughs> Handy hand. <laughs> Oh god. Ugh. Reg, that's his name? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Rico, I think that was her name, and Reg, okay. Oh. Hmm. Oh, the sunrise. There you go.
Well, like it's crazy how everyone's living in this place, you know, on the on the slanting portion of the abyss. Oh. Wow. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So I remember that. Okay, so she he has amnesia, uh, kind of. The deeper you go, the greater emotion. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Dizziness, vomiting. Yeah. Yeah. Oh boy. Loss of humanity or death. Ah. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> we still don't know if he's a robot or not. Like. Hmm. Unheard bell. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. It can't be cut. Oh. Oh, interesting. Wow. Wait, what? Oh my, okay. What? Oh my. Yeah, the kid is like <laughs> uh -huh. mm. so he's like a fusion of a human and a orbit special treasure Yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. I think it's okay. Yeah. Um. Don't know. Amnesia. Amnesia.
Oh boy. Hmm. No, 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 no. But, but it's, it was her dog's name. Oh, so he didn't re Okay. I thought he would realize that it's her dog's name, so why is her. I don't know. I feel like he. he I don't remember this part at all. Okay. <laughs> Strong. <laughs> you. Um, pay attention, please. Oh yeah, the whole uh, like you know like stringing up as uh. Oh, he makes a right Rico bomb. Okay, that's what he calls. She calls them. <laughs> Two months. Three more days. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hey yo this is attack on titan <laughs> they're coming back let's go and meet them oh boy they're back wow it's like a the whole lift uh, elevator is like a oh yeah this guy Habo Habo is that is that a white whistle oh it's it's her it's her mom isn't mom's isn't it oh no maybe not Liza that that was her name. Yeah, yeah, that's that's her mom's name. Oh boy. Yeah, she she knew up until now she knew that her mom is not alive or something. Oh. Devilish bit of this. Moon whistle, black whistle, ah, the white whistle. And that's Liza, okay. Damn, it's crazy how everyone's like, oh, the whistle is back, but the person is not back, so, oh. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Resurrection Festival. Okay.
टू इयर्स ओल्ड हम्म हेवी ड्रिंकर या जस्ट लाइक यू आइस वेट ओ वॉट ओ बिकॉज ऑफ द बेस Yeah, her mom was there, you know, when she was in her belly. <laughs> well, ah, fourth layer. अनहर्ड बेल तोड़का नो 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 हम्म ये आई वंडर शी वॉज बॉर्न देर सो Oh abandoned oh I'm just one second ओके ओके मेक सेंस हम्म यो यू हैट ओ Oh. Okay. I was thinking. So why do they have the bell now? If if she left it, okay. That that explains it. ओके हा ओह यो दैट दैट पिक्चर आई रिमेंबर इन द एंड
Like him, like him, kind of. Wait, is that a letter? That looks like some kind of a drawing. Oh yeah, okay. I'll be waiting. Yep. Okay, so that's why... Yeah. Yeah, that's why she decided to go, okay. Mm. Ah. <laughs> my god oh my god uh. <laughs> <laughs> ah Wait, can you even dig that? What is that? It's like a metal plate. Whoa! Oh, that's us. <laughs> it doesn't even need to... Need to... Ah. That's a weird looking thing. Oh my god. It looks like an egg. What is that? Oh. You're also an apprentice. Okay. You just... Oh, another one. Oh my god. Oh! Yeah. Brain skeleton. Oh! <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, really? Okay. Ah, go. Well. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> One thing. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, imagine going to the bottom, like the, the complete bottom. Like, as they say, like, nobody's been able to go there. Everyone dies. Lose their humanity or whatever.
Hmm. Oh ya. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yo. Uh. Can please wipe that? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. But it's not... Yeah. All right, map. Hmm. <laughs> wow, that's kind of quite a detailed. Damn, look at the layers. Okay. Second layer, forest of temptation. Headache and dizziness. Ah. Oh. oh my god. Inverting forest. Okay. Great fault. Ah. Okay. Goblet of Giants. Oh boy. Hmm. Oh my god. Oh boy. <laughs> Probably. Ah, <sighs> well. Uh, true.
Yeah. Uh, one by one into ten minutes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it sick? Oh. oh my god, the whole thing that Naps said. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Oh! Oh, <laughs> patrolling, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, why? Like, can't people? Yep, he knows. Right, here we go. Never actually been to the wall for Ah, there you go. That's him, isn't it? Yeah, that's <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> She did say she's going to forgive. Yeah. No. Yeah, but. Okay. Oh, Billy's kept being added on the corner. Oh, hmm. Wait, she said the same thing. Oh, he he told him to say that because he is the one. Okay. Uh. <laughs> oh god yeah ooh What the? Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, all right, let's go. Yeah, yeah. All right. From here onwards, I remember barely anything from here onwards. The first part I kind of remember bits and pieces. Like I'm completely blank from here. I don't know why. I remember nothing. Again, the final portion, I have to kind of remember the final two episodes, I think. The whole thing with that girl. Not girl, who, that, that, that little thing. The backstory and everything. But before that, I, I forgot everything. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was like a... Drop directly from the wall district. Uh, okay. Eight twenty. Yeah. Uh. Wow. Oh my God! Look at this. Brighter here than it's on the surface. Ah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she's hungry. Uh, did they bring food? I think so. Yeah, yeah, she, they did bring food. Or maybe not. Wait, uh, is he like catching fishes or something? Did he not bring food? I, I guess... Oh, okay. Eternal fortunes. That kind of looks not, yeah, questionable, but I guess the taste is what all matters. Okay, there you go, it's okay. <laughs> the appearance is kind of, you know, but as long as it tastes good, Oh, that's a compass, isn't he? She said something. Tells you from up and down. 
Oh, no. Oh, okay. Oh, that arrow. It's like... Oh, interesting. I thought it was because of gravity, but no, probably not. Oh my god! Wow, okay, well... Um, there it goes. Um, yeah. So she lost it? Oh my god. Oh, that thing. Oh, did, did the leader write it or something? I think so, when... Oh, no, wait. Oh, someone wrote it down properly. Probably the leader. Yeah. Nah. Okay. Oh my god. Uh. Wait. Ah. Yeah, obviously everyone will get alerted that they are out so yes dude. hmm Oh, okay. Okay. Forest of oh, they're already kind of here. Hmm. Okay. Oh my god, she's, she's, she's getting dizzy. Uh -huh. She's getting dizzy, yeah. Okay. Okay, I had to leave my seat for a little bit. I had, I'll make sure it's properly synced. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like they were talking pretty loudly. You know? Yeah. Oh, it's again. No, no, wait. Oh my god, what the. Oh, Habo. I think his name is Habo? Oh boy. Habo. Well, to bring you back. Oh my god. <laughs> well. Uh. Okay. Ah.
Oh my god. Reg when you get a chance. Run. Well, yeah. <laughs> I don't think he's here to take them back. Okay, there you go. Oh, he they told him to help him. Okay. Ah, uh, that's how he convinced him. Mm. Be respects. <laughs> Twisting crack. Okay, still a lot above. How did he find them so quickly? Like, hmm. wait, she wants to. Yeah, she wants to go there alone. Not alone, but. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he at least saw the the relic or whatever. What? Vaccine. Ah. Guardian is a Ozen. Okay. Ah. Oh, the other person who. I don't remember anything about this part. Okay, so this Ozen is the same person who helped them out of when she was pregnant, I think. Yeah. Hmm. Right. Is he, is he eating? Oh. They're quite deep down? Or, or they, they, they reach the second layer? Is that what's happening? Wow. Oh, yeah, they're at the entrance. Or, yeah, kind of like that. Foils of Temptation. <laughs> nah. I don't think so. Okay, well, but you have to think about these things. Yeah. Damn, look at that thing. Ah. Uh. Yeah.
Is this a... What the... Oh, he was able to sense it. Yeah, his his senses are a bit heightened, like more than Rico. Oh my God! What the ah? Oh my God! It ah, it took its yeah. Cop sweeper. Oh my god. Yeah. But oh my god, it noticed you. Oh. Alright, guys, you need to move. Oh my god. Okay. Ah. What the hell? What? Whoa, there's so many of them. Ascending within the abyss. Oh. Oh, you're gonna get nauseous. Okay. Use a beam or whatever, I don't know. <sighs> yeah, that's the voice that he's hearing. Oh, the beam. Yep, there you go. Damn! Ooh! God! Wow! Oh my god! That's a strong... Annihilated the holes. Oh yeah, she's falling! Nice. God. Okay, so you cannot ascend quickly, I'm guessing. You're gonna vomit and everything. Wow, oh my god. He did this before when when trying to save Rico. Yeah. God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You just blew the whole place up. Yep. Yeah. 
<laughs> Reg beam. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, he thinks that if but that was the only choice he had at that moment. Nothing he could do. What? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Wait, she measured it? I had a little, okay. Ah, that's what she's trying to say, okay. Is he getting dizzy? Oh, a lot of expenditure of power. I was thinking, like, is there like any side effect of using the beam? Or maybe it's something else. What is this? Wait, I was under the impression that the curse doesn't get to him. Does the curse get to him then? Oh. Ah, oh. what? I think that's why it ha Okay. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Oh, that thing. Yeah, probably. Mm. Somewhere over here. <laughs> well, <laughs> what? Ah, wow, she, she, she thinks far and wide, like, you know, her. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, that doesn't seem like fun. <laughs> oh god. Wow. The the then descending quite a lot. I wonder where what which layer they are in now like at what part of the layer okay here we go lowest part uh, inverted forest there you go so the beginning of third layer wow that's crazy oh the 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 wind hmm it should be like gold Okay. Okay. What? Oh, it's giving that thing to her. Probably not. <laughs> oh, is, is this that? What was the name? The uh, immovable or something?
Wow, okay, that was Hmm Everything's inverted, look at this, yeah Even the camp is inverted Oh yeah, that's what that person was. I remember nothing about this part. What the hell? Okay, what's happening? Oh, someone caught him. Is, is that that person? The immovable or whatever? What was the name? Wait, this person knows? Correct? Ascending. She's getting more nauseous. Yeah. Oh, th this is a girl, isn't it? Yeah. He is tall. What the? Oh. Yes, it's tall. Two meters. <laughs> what? White whistle, yeah. What was her name? Ozen, okay, yeah, that was her name. <laughs> yeah, she and her, Liza both. It was her, wasn't it? Yeah, it was her. Okay. <laughs> Well, yeah. That kid would have come with me. What? Okay. Oh boy. Ah. Marin look. She, she is that a he or a she? A blue whistle? Talks in a does I think this is a boy, isn't it? Is that Boku. Hmm. 
not necessarily that girls can't say boku but i'm just saying you know ah yeah true true <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. This is a boy or a girl. I don't remember anything about this part. I don't know why, but I forgot this part completely. What the hell? Wow, what? 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 Oh, nice. This is a very... Washing relics. Uh. Class of fortitude. Ah. Uh. I think he's not a robot, but like a mixture of a robot or a human, I think. Yeah, there you go. Mario, look. Yeah, I was thinking. No, I think this is a boy. Sensitive, okay. Ah, uh, that's interesting. Hmm. Hmm. But she's uh, or he. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. And this place is creepy. Oh my god. Don't peek. Uh. Here we go. Curiosity. Oh boy. I honestly remember nothing what happened here. Okay, what? Oh, what the? Whoa, what is? What the? What is that? She peed? <laughs> oh, she went back without peeing. <laughs> oh, she went and I guess. <laughs> yeah. A mutated thing. Yeah.
Yeah, that was not a ghost, but... <laughs> well... Uh... What? Not like you're asking like that, so I don't think so. <laughs> the way she said that. Yeah. Hmm. Oh boy. Great. What the? Oh. Who made it? What? Oh boy. Damn. Wait, so it was not something that Liza wrote? She says it's not her handwriting. Yeah, what was that weird creature we saw last night? She knows something. She or he, I don't know. The boy or girl. What the? Is that like dress? Yeah. Whoa, what? Oh, that's a cube. Great. So this is hidden here. Oh. Half right. Whoa! Oh my god! Living is that cannot make that trip. Ah. Then it's a resurrecting. So she died but came back. Still, oh my God. So this is a resurrecting thing or something. My God. That thing we saw. I I forgot everything about this part. My god. Ah, yeah, this thing. Head for the center. 
Oh my god. Yeah, the things that come from the abyss must return to the abyss. It's crazy. Like, she was born in the abyss, so she's... Oh, wait. <laughs> is, is she becoming bigger? She's becoming bigger, isn't she? Damn. That's why no one's able to come back. must not exist Oh my god. <laughs> She's not budging. Wow. Oh, whoa. Oh, my God. Damn. He really is sturdy. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. oh God. Oh my God. One. Oh, he's going to use that. <laughs> A fireworks show. Yeah. Oh, she, he's making it even. My God, she's huge. What the hell? Okay. God. Yeah, that's what happens. God. Oh, he cannot. Wait, what's with the hand? Thousand men. Oh. 
What the? Wow. Oh, this is... This is Ozen we saw in the beginning, you remember? Yeah, 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 yeah. Who was eating food with Liza? Oh god. Oh my god. Would fail. Oh. Wait, who are these people? What happened? What after that? Subterranean Bandit. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> yeah, true. Uh. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, okay, that's what she Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Well, okay. That's true. Hmm. Ah, <sighs> yeah. One thing of oh, this. Okay, there you go. Oh, yeah, that's. Hmm. 
Okay, but what about the handwriting? She said like someone else wrote the letter? Was that also a lie? Or a deceive? I don't know. Not very good. <laughs> okay. So they're going to train here? Hmm. I'll treat that an escape attempt, okay. Well, obviously. What? Oh, so it's going to blow up or something? Ah, okay, makes sense. Yeah, he nothing. He'll she, she, he won't come back. So that at that moment, Rico's vulnerable. Yeah. 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 If he misses somehow, it's over. Oh, well Okay, let's start our, our training I, our, I guess Hmm A3 Oh, this old man keeping an eye on them Oh, he's a purple whistle, okay He's constantly losing his nerve. Ah. What the? A5. Hippo, that's a hippo? Uh, will that work? Ah! That! Is that... Yeah, done. Ah! Huh. Probably? Oh, they, no, wait. Oh, they're burning it so that the smell goes. Okay. Ah, <laughs> look at him. It's like, ah, where is it? All right. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, but what would happen if someone is not able to do something for a moment? The other person will have to... Oh, this is... Is this Liza?
Oh. Oh my god. How cool. <laughs> Turka. Oh wait, he was the dad? Oh. The the one we saw in the beginning who was giving them food. Yep, there you go. This is when it happens. Wow, this cube is crazy. This cube or whatever. Like, it brings things to life. Oh boy. Ah, they're back. <laughs> Ten days. <laughs> it's sleeping. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. Damn. Oh, is, is it changing? Is that like a shows you how much you leveled up or something? It, it changes. <laughs> Wow. That was nice. It was kind of like a picnic, you know. <laughs> oh boy. Don't stay in there if you don't want to kill. Oh. Damn, that looks good. Wait, so how much? Oh. Okay.
ada tuh oke okay. so it's uncharted territory oh oke okay. makes sense all right that's what she was trying to say Oh, okay, okay. It's fifty. Hmm. Wondered. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, what was that? So it was not her. Oh, wow. Hmm. Oh, is that like a interesting Everlex Pickaxe? Oh, she brought it with them, her. Okay. So telling she's basically telling them to use it. Yeah. Yeah. We do need a weapon, you know. But Rico needs to wield this. Uh, like you know. Ah, uh, she's probably just on top looking at them. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm. Came back on set. Hmm. Quick to pick up on oh oh well, kind of like Liza I guess Liza also picked it up quite quickly baby called up toward the ah. <laughs> yeah. Also, nobody knew that it was lies.
Her voice. Is it Maya Sakamoto, her voice actor? Oh. The thing that Ozan was saying that, you know, like you became more and more softer. Yeah. Oh, she told her to tell every. Okay, okay. So it was not. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, she told her to do that. Hmm. Oh, well. Yep. Great fall, third layer. Give everything up. Oh uh, yeah, I remember her. The final portion I kind of remember a little bit. I even remember her story a little bit, but this part I completely forgot. The whole Ozen situation, I didn't remember anything. I don't know why. Like, it was like a blank in my memory in that part. But there you go, I got caught up, rewatched it. There you go, I know now. Wow. Okay, so... The first part, the first eight episodes was covered in this, I'm guessing. The next one I'm going to do next week, which will cover the final few episodes. And then I think movie three is something different, which I've not seen. So movie three will be a new experience for me. And then obviously the anime is going to come back. All right. Wow. So there's quite a few things that I completely forgot. And now I remember again the whole abyss what it is you know and the whole thing of how Rico was a stillborn i completely forgot about that you know and um, so that was a big surprise for me again and and when they told like when ozan said that oh you're actually uh, a stillborn and uh, i remembered at that moment like oh yeah this is something that happened before that i completely forgot and uh, there's so many things about this uh, show that if you like, you know, like, you know, there's like so many mysteries and everything they kind of show you in the beginning. Oh, they're over there now. Okay. okay. Wandering Twilight. Okay, that's, I'll do it next week. Is that it? I think so. Um, yep, that is it. All right, okay, before we begin, one thing I need to do is. Check who's Liza's voice actor is. I think it's Maya Sakamoto, isn't it? Uh, I'm pretty sure because I've heard her voice so many times. Liza, let, let's check her voice actor. Uh, voice actor, say you. Maya Sakamoto, there you go. I knew it. I've, we cannot. 
Her voice, I remember. I, 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 I recognize it all the time. Okay, so the first movie, which is the compilation of the first eight episodes, and uh, like you know, obviously this is the story about uh, Rico finding a little robot boy uh, who we still don't know if it's a complete robot or, or something else called and he, he called calls him Reg. she calls him Reg, and uh, their journey towards the bottom of the abyss where they found out their uh, uh, Rico's mom might be waiting so um, first of all the first part we get to see the whole section of uh, uh, Liza to to Tora or to to Toru something like that was the name of the boy uh, the uh, uh, you know Liza's husband I think I forgot his name but that person you know uh, who was actually giving them food I did not realize that was actually Rico's father and uh, obviously Ozen was there at that moment I also did not realize that was Ozen because of the big thing and they did not show her face um. So all these things they kind of showed us in the beginning and I don't think they ever showed us in, in the anime or probably I just forgot about that. Uh, either way, uh, the whole story is, this is such an interesting story because it has so many things. Uh, first of all, the, the, the world building you could say here is so interesting, like basically everything is happening in the abyss. We do realize that there's like a whole world outside this abyss, you know and uh, this abyss is only a small part of it but for them this small abyss is their whole world this kind of reminds me of attack on titan at the beginning where all we got to know was the uh, world be behind the walls the walls and 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 uh, like you know paradise island was all that we knew about attack on titan but as further we go on in the story we get to know that there's a whole world waiting for us so many enemies on the other side of the <laughs> of the water so yeah like this also kind of reminds me of that because now our whole world is the abyss the abyss and and the people living over there in in that city i forgot the city's name but we did see in the beginning that the abyss is like an actually like a whole kind of thing in, in the middle of a water body or something like a place so there's like a huge world outside also waiting so I don't know how they're going to tackle this. I'm guessing this will only be like, you know, just related to the base because it's called um, like, you know, like uh, uh, the wait, um, a made in abyss. Yeah, made in abyss. I, <laughs> I forgot the name for the anime for a moment there. My God, <laughs> like I kind of mixed it mixes, mix this uh, name up with Tales of Abyss, you know, even though that that anime and that that gameplay and the ga game video game Tales of Abyss, I, I always mix the two names up. <laughs> anyways so yeah now i'm guessing this will only be like i don't know i've not read the night novel not the, i don't even know if this, this has a manga or something but from the looks of it it feels like this will only be the abyss you know like they're going to go down deep down there's so many things that's left to be discovered it'll only be that so i doubt this is going to go in the attack on titan direction where like you know later on they came out of the island and actually went to the outside world as well but that's just a guess i'm i don't know maybe they, it will happen in the future but for now we are only in the only in the abyss and there's so many things to left left to actually find out in the abyss and uh, as i was saying the world building is fantastic i love the sceneries and everything and as i was saying this would make a really amazing video game i feel like you know like there's like layers upon layers and you know you have to go and like there will be like an like an open world type of a part where people can like you know hunt kind of like you could say horizon dawn zero i i can see this happening like that you know like that type of a thing uh like the way horizon dawn zero did the whole like you know open world sections and everything uh, i could see it happen like that or maybe near automata you know uh it, it gives gives me vibes like you know of, of those, those video games either way you know they can like you know like it, it, this will make an amazing video game if someone makes it I, I don't know if this gets popular enough this is quite popular however but it suddenly stopped making like you know more <laughs> sequels and now after so many years we're getting another sequel so i'm guessing this is going to continue so if this somehow someday get, gets popular enough to actually be like attack on titan or the main like you know shows the mainstream shows uh 
probably in the future this can become a video game because i can see so much potential in this to become a video game you know it'll be amazing like like a whole open world section with you can hunting uh, like you know animals defeating monsters and going down and down anyways like you know that's a completely tangent i went on but what i was trying to say is like this this is amazing the world building everything the story in itself is really like you know interesting uh the, her mom is waiting in the like you know somewhere in the in, in the abyss and she is there to find her out and reg a, a, a person who they don't know who he is what you know, what type of a person he is where he came from they're accompanying he's accompanying her on her journey now <clears throat> uh there was obviously the first part was them actually explaining the whole thing then we are we seeing the people like you know her, uh, rico's friends rico finding reg and reg saving rico from that that huge monster and we saw everything the orphanage and everything like you know like we got to see how people are celebrating that uh the 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 whistle the white whistle liza's white whistle is back and i'm pretty sure everyone also thinks that she is there somewhere underneath and uh, all these things happens and uh, after getting the letter uh, where it's written i'll be waiting in the abyss uh, rico got the, her motivation to go to the abyss and uh, uh, reg decided to join her because reg also wants to know where he came from and uh, like one interesting thing that they kind of said here is they said how uh whatever is from the abyss abyss i think rico says that whatever comes from the abyss is returned to the abyss so i don't know if this is like an um like a future uh what, what do you call it like a uh like a future hint as to what is to come because interestingly both reg and uh, rico are from the abyss aren't they like we don't know where reg was born and what happened to him you know where he came from but for from the looks of it it seems like he was also from the he is also from the abyss um rico however is pretty much confirmed that she's also from the abyss she was born in the abyss so like you know the, her actually telling that whatever comes from the abyss goes back to the abyss is an interesting i don't i think like a foreshadowing or like a hint as to what's probably going to come in the future like how we can see how both of them are attracted towards the abyss all his friend her their friends were like okay like you, know, you should not go there you know like you should not go to the abyss no one knows what it is and all that stuff they were saying while these two they're like oh we need to go to the abyss which is so interesting because uh as far as we know both came from the abyss that's why the abyss is probably calling them back you know like you know, they're returning to the abyss now again and uh i don't know like you know this is like a very interesting way to kind of look at this and um uh, yeah now a few things uh we also okay uh let's go uh step by step after that uh, rico like you know like uh and you know their friends kind of like you know say goodbye this and that they go inside the abyss uh reg and rico start their journey and uh you know like they they, they get uh they kind of go to you kind know, of meet the the huge monster comes in that thing that birdie thing and uh here reg again uses her his beam the incinerating cannon that he called and uh, from here onwards like you know um they can understand what the uh dangers of the abyss are and uh, they continue their journey to the seeker camp where so many interesting thing happens and from here onwards i was completely blank i remembered nothing first of all we meet a few characters marluk i think that was the name i don't even know if that's a boy or a girl i think my guess is that that's a boy most probably um anyways um and obviously ozen now <coughs> ozen is such an interesting character you know like she she has that mysterious vibe with the whole huge like you know towering monster her like you know smile like you know like that like that like as a character like you know she's so interesting her character design her personality and everything matches so well like you know that mysterious vibe that she has that and her name as well Oz, ozen the immovable like you know it, he's like she's like a towering giant and her name is just perfect for her and uh, it was you know like like you know meeting her and getting to see uh like you know like people warned them that ozen is kind of you know a little bit weird in some ways so be careful of her 
<laughs> and we get to see and there was there was that little battle we got in with you know like ozen fought them and ozen told them about the reality she kind of like you know lied a little bit about uh like you know the grave that the mom was in and she says like oh like you know like that grave like you know she's probably dead and she tells how someone wrote the a letter someone else it was not liza who wrote it which is true however as she said now you know like um so you know what is interesting here someone else wrote the letter now you know what that means i think i, I i'm thinking of it in that way the, in the letter it was written in the bottom of the abyss i will be waiting it does not mean that it it was like it since if it was not liza who wrote it then it was someone else who told rico that i'll be waiting that means not necessarily her mom is like i'm pretty sure her mom is there as well but it was not necessarily about her mom it was about someone else who wrote the letter and told them that i will be waiting so i'm kind of curious about the fact that who would even write something to um uh, Rico and say that oh I will be waiting because the only person I can see that doing that is her mom and if her mom did not write that it was someone else another person I could see doing this is her dad but her dad is dead I think so it won't it, it, it is not also his dad uh, her dad who wrote it so who is it that wrote that letter that I'll be waiting you know in the abyss if it's not the mom and like you know if it's not the mom who is waiting for her there like this is a question I, I suddenly like you know I, I, it popped up in my head because it's not Liza who wrote the letter that means it's someone else who said that I'll be waiting so I don't know like you know I'm 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 we will we will get to see about what what's happening over them and probably in the future seasons or something but for now that was an interesting thing and like you know Olsen kind of lied a little bit kind of changed the story a little bit and uh, you know like kind of discouraged them trying to see how they will be able to fight off it like you know that or how much uh, or whether they will like you know give up and go back or something but no they had their courage they kept their determination and ozen in the end was like all right i'm going to help you out give them a little training a 10-day training in the, the place and saw that they are also will probably be capable enough to handle the abyss and uh, yeah after that uh, we get to know the actual reality of what it is. There's a few things that she told was the truth and we see everything properly and clearly. First of all, um, uh, the whole, like, you know, like when we saw Liza, like, you know, was very sad after probably the her husband died and after uh, Rico and like, you know, as was like a stillborn. She was sad at that moment and we see that little flashback. Here we get to know that what she told like i was kind of thinking did she did that the fact that she is a stillborn was also a lie but no that was truth she was a stillborn and that did happen the only lie that she said was like um her grave eliza's grave she dug it and, and there was no one in it so there's a huge chance that liza is there somewhere in the abyss and uh, yeah that was the only little lie that she told and she was there kind of like testing them out and uh, yeah now a few other things we get to know is almost at the end of the story where ozen kind of reminiscences about the past about how she met liza and the interesting thing about the whole like you know like section is liza's change in personality throughout the whole thing first the first how ozen met her and what ozen was probably like you know very fascinated with liza was her like you know like drive to go to the bottom of the abyss her drive to become like a person like a strong person and like you know she was uh she was very strong she didn't like you know was very rough and rash and it uh, doing things and she did her things in her own way she was cheerful and everything and all these things like you know we see the little part where she says like oh ozen you can be can, can you become my master you know can you teach me stuff when ozen was there you know like that first meeting we see that and we can see how what probably attracted Ozen to that little kid and uh, you know like that's that was those qualities that Ozen liked about Liza you know uh, her strength her like you know like optimism uh, her determination all these things and uh, after uh, you know like her husband died and after like you know like Rico came like after both these two came to her lives Ozan says how she started to lose 
all of that and we see that little scene where she says something like oh after you two came came to her life she started losing all the things that you know like made her this tough she, she's becoming soft you know that that is one thing that she was probably not able to accept because she loved uh eliza's optimism like you know these things that she had which she little by little started to lose after she lost both her husband and her child you know that's why like you know ozan was a little bitter at that moment but after that we see when they come outside and when like you know like uh liza gives uh rico to her um disciple that guy i forgot his name the the white-haired kid um and told him to take care of rico and uh, that's when you know she says that if i get attached to these type of things you know i feel i'm i feel like i'm going to lose it you know i'm going to lose that drive to go to the bottom of the abyss that's why you know like i'll be i'll be like you know like rico will be the shackle which attaches me to this world and uh, you know like i won't be able to go there you know i will become attached to this world to rico and to my life so i think that's what she says over there and to avoid that she gave the um i think she gave uh the duty to take care of rico to to that kid and that's why she went to ozen and in the end she says that let's go to the abyss again because i want to find out and we can see like you know ozen smiles at that moment which shows how liza again reverted back to the way she was in the beginning when ozen met her the, the qualities that liza uh, about liza that ozen liked came back to her for that moment and uh, that's probably something that made her happy ozen at that moment uh, you know she's not soft anymore but at the same time that also does not mean that she does not care about her child that is rico you know she made ample like you know arrangements and everything and you know she also wanted her to take, make her decision whether she wants to go to the abyss or not if she stays with uh liza you know like rico would probably just follow her footsteps which i think liza also did not want to happen liza just gave her the opportunity to either stay or come follow her you know in the abyss so that was another thing that she did i guess and uh, you know like she she also wants a day probably when rico will be able to join her in the abyss you know alongside her or something and that's why she said like if someday my daughter comes to you you know tell her about these type these things about how she was a stillborn and all these things you know and uh, yeah just you know like test her a little bit and uh, help help her out and uh, that's what ozen did ozen did everything that liza told her so all the things that we were seeing like you know she was kind of acting uh, the way she ozen was acting with them was in a way kind of something that liza told her to do kind of test them whether they are capable enough to go to the uh, abyss and there you go that that's what Ozen did by the end and he acted like a like a nasty person a villainous type of attitude she had but yeah she's she's okay I guess uh, like I feel like o Ozen is like a neutral character like a neutral type of character she's neither like you know like a good person nor a bad person that type of a person and she's like in the middle in the gray zone so in, in the gray zone and kind of like you know leaning towards the good part a little bit otherwise she wouldn't help them and um, yeah so ozen is nice but you know like she doesn't let that show and she did everything that liza told her to and you know gave them a little boost and also handed them the pickaxe she also told how uh um, Rex should avoid using the incinerator otherwise it'll be a big problem if she because you know he he's going to like go unconscious and what's going to happen to rico at that moment so that's why the pickaxe is like an alternative to that so yeah that is what happens like that's what i was saying you know like interesting we thing we saw is like the way liza completely changed from the beginning like and at the beginning she was that uh that type of a um like you know just optimistic uh, very cheerful wants to go to the abyss that type of person which ozen lo loved and then like you know after uh, her husband and uh, rico came to her life she started to get attached to her life she started to have fear for her own life because of her family you know like all like a you know, family always kind of like you know kind of 
shackles you down to these type of like you know in these type of situations so which Olsen probably did not like a little bit you know but then again later on after losing her husband and bringing Rico back she decided to let Rico be alone for a moment and let her take a decision whether she's going to go to the abyss or not and at the same time she herself her own passion her own determination the like you know the end of the abyss she wants to see that so she was like yeah I'm going to do that again which again Ozen probably appreciated because that's how she started the whole thing I don't know and uh, that was whole of the full of Liza story while Rico's story as we can see you know she wants to find her mom and to do that she can she's definitely going to go to the abyss and uh, Reg we still don't know anything about Reg you know there's that weird vision not vision but these weird sounds that she was he was hearing sounds of him talking that's like a mystery what that was which we'll probably get to know later on and uh, other than that she he everyone's telling that she, he's a robot but you know like there's portions of him that is like human so i feel like he's like a like a mixture of both like an hybrid or something like that we still don't know who he is but what his identity is but i'm sure we'll get to know as the anime delves deeper into the whole thing and that's where it ends and okay that was the first part the next part i will be reacting to next week which will co cover the final few episodes i guess and this part i remember a lot of things and i remember it's very sad and very uncomfortable especially oh my god the last few episodes i remember especially that backstory of that I, I i forgot her name that that little bunny girl or whatever she is uh, her backstory is kind of sad and i don't remember those but details i forgot that's why i'm basically watching this because before the new sequel starts so yeah next week i'll be back with the next part of this movie so that's it guys thanks for watching this was my reaction to made in abyss movie number one this was a recap of the first eight episodes and uh, yeah i remember most of the things now i'm kind of caught up to the things and the final few episodes i'll be uh, uh sorry the final few uh, sections which constitute movie number two next week i'll be reacting to it same day so if you're interested be sure to tune in so thanks for watching if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed and comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know and i'll check them out so that's it guys thanks for watching and i will see you guys next week with the next part of the movie so yeah see you guys then until then goodbye and have a nice day